that you never thought you'd see this face again. Waiting on the shuttle bus. We're at Princess Parking at the one hut. My car, see it right there. It's nice. Um, however, I when I was walking over here, I just looked. <laughs> uh, the Spirit flight. If I don't make this Southwest flight at 4:50, uh, it was supposed to be at 6:20. They pushed it back to 6:50, and now it's saying it's still not delayed at 6:50, but it's delayed landing until midnight don't really know what that means so keep you updated hope I get on the Southwest flight not me not being at the airport and the fountain isn't even running how rude okay so I did not get on um, that flight there's a flight at, um, don't let me forget my AirPod is right there. There's a flight at 6.20, but it's delayed until 10 now. But there's an eight o'clock flight and I'm nervous that everyone is going to try and get on the eight o'clock flight. And then that would leave me here till six or till 10. Otherwise there's a 6.30 a.m. flight tomorrow. This is the struggles of commuting people don't talk about. But like, look how cute this room key is. Also, I haven't been to a hotel with a mini bar in it in like a really long time. Good morning, everyone. Um, so I ended up making it to New Orleans last night. Uh, I think I did tell you guys that. I did. So I uh, made it to New Orleans on Spirit. They came in clutch and uh, I met up with a friend. She was like walking around New Orleans. Um, she's on a different crew and we like hung out for like an hour. Then I came back and I fell asleep and it's daylight savings time. So I got an extra hour of sleep. Not only did I get an extra hour of sleep because I'm on central time right now, but I got an extra hour of sleep with daylight savings time. So I feel like I'm really refreshed, even though I went to bed at like one o'clock. <laughs> but um, it's 7.30, our van is in an hour, so I'm going to get ready and head down to the van and do our one leg to Minneapolis and then I commute home. For the OGs, this is for you. I'm ready. Uh, in case we were wondering, <laughs> this is from a Torret. It's good chemistry in the scent Queen Bee. Chef's kiss, I love it. Okay, so I am just almost ready to head downstairs. Um, it is about, actually I'm really early. I thought I was gonna be late. It only took me 30 minutes to get ready. Um, it's 8.04, so I have to be downstairs in about 20-ish minutes. So I'm gonna pack up my bag, probably watch a little bit of TikTok, have a Celsius, and uh, head downstairs for our one leg to Minneapolis. They put ice in it, so I'm assuming, and it's full. Do you need any cream or sugar with your coffee? Uh, a little bit more for you. Uh, 
about cream to sugar. Yeah. Well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Orlando. Please remain seated with your seatbelt securely fastened until the aircraft has been safely parked at the terminal building and the captain has turned off the fastened seatbelt sign. You'll then have time to check on the seating area in the overhead compartment spaces for any items you may have brought on board with you. Use caution when opening up the overhead compartments as items may have shifted during the flight. Also, check in that seat back pocket in front of you for any keys, wallets, earpods. This airplane will be turning right around going back to Minneapolis. On behalf of the entire flight crew, we'd like to thank you for flying with us today. Local time here is now 542. Enjoy your stay here in the Orlando area. If this is your home, welcome home.